ladies and gentlemen, Kitty Worthman. Thank you very much. You. I was born in Austria, and I lived there seven years under Hitler's brutal regime. And after World War II, three years under Soviet communist occupation. In 1938, the media reported that Hitler rolled into Austria with tanks and guns and took us over. Not true at all. The Austrian people elected Hitler by 98% of the vote by means of the ballot box. Now, you might ask, how could a Christian nation almost 100% Catholic, to elect a monster like Hitler. The truth is, at the beginning, Hitler didn't look like or talk like a monster at all. He talked like an American politician. <laughs> we also had gun registration. Oh, the Austrian people had all, they all had guns. But the government said, the guns are very dangerous. Children are playing with guns. Hunting accidents happen. And we really have to have total control, safety. And we had criminals again. And the only way that we can trace the criminal was by the serial number of the gun. So we dutifully went to the police station and we registered our guns. Not long after, they said, no, it didn't help. The only way that we don't have accidents and crimes, you bring the guns to the police station, and then we don't have any crimes anymore and any accidents. And if you don't do that, capital punishment. So that's what we did. <clears throat> So dictatorship didn't happen overnight. It took five years, gradually, little by little, to escalate up to a dictatorship. When the people fear the government, that's tyranny. But when the government fears the people, that's you, that's liberty. <laughs> Keep your guns. Keep your guns and buy more guns. <laughs>